Hey guys, Erin here of Apple Updates with a video on some tips and tricks for our iOS 7. So, <clears throat> number one, when you first unlock your device, you can actually access Notification Center from the lock screen, so you don't need to unlock it for that. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Next thing is you can also access uh, your uh, control center from the lock screen. Uh, so that's pretty cool. I'll get to that in just a second. Uh, next thing, of course, uh, is nothing new, but you can access the camera uh, from Notification Center. So let's close that and yeah. But I mean, um, I'm in the beta version, so I don't know if you could tell. Uh, okay. So the next thing is that once you're unlocked, well, once you're uh, in the lock screen, you don't need to put your finger on the slide to unlock wordings. You can put your finger anywhere else on the screen and go ahead and drag it and slide to unlock. Uh, another thing is uh, that when you, when you could be anywhere in the uh, device and all you have to do is pull up from the bottom and you are greeted with the control center. Um, so now once you're in the control center, of course, you can uh, change around your settings, turn on and off your Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, for orientation lock, um, turn on all these, you know, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, um, airplane mode, do not disturb, uh, and portrait orientation lock. Uh, the next thing, of course, is you can change your brightness uh, and a nice cool thing here is that they've included a flat a quick access um button to the flashlight so you can activate your flashlight um from anywhere in the device so that's a pretty nice feature um pretty cool uh and i like it uh another uh new uh feature or another tip and trick uh is that you can actually have apps inside folders and in the folders, you can have multiple pages. Now, in order to uh, create a folder, what you need to do is take one app, hold down, go ahead and drag it onto another app. And this will create a nice folder. Now, of course, you could have multiple pages in the folder, like I said. In order to change the name of a folder, what you'll want to do is go into a folder and then you could change over what it says here so um we could change it like that now uh as long as i'm typing i'd like to say uh, that if you don't feel like typing um what you can do is you can press this little microphone button thingy and you can uh talk in it and you could uh, speech to text let's see if i can demo it real quick Productivity. Just wait for that little ding, and then uh, there you go. It's going to uh, load, and it heard what I said, and it translated it into text. Um, so another thing is that uh, in order to uh, get to the new multitasking pane, just double press the home button, and there it is. Now, if you want to close out of an app, there's no uh, you know, pressing to hold. So what you do is you just drag the item off uh, on top. You just drag it to the top and it'll uh, close out and exit. Um, in order to take a screenshot, uh, of course, just press and hold the, oops, just press and hold the power button and home button at the same time. I don't think I did it well. Uh, again, let's try that. There you go. Um, so those are my tips and tricks for iOS 7. If I left anything out, please feel free to leave a comment uh, down below. And that is all. All right, guys, have a great day.